Hello, my name is Tom Boo, and I'm the Associate Director for Mission at the Outreach Foundation, and I'm coming to you live from my home uh, in Birmingham, Alabama. But I'm about to get onto a plane uh, heading to the southern part of Pakistan, Karachi, I'm bringing a team of three other people with me, including Barry Long, who is a trustee at the Outreach Foundation, and Jim Truesdell, who is an associate director with the uh, Frontier Fellowship. We are being hosted uh, for this visit by Pak Mission Society. It's a it's a Christian NGO in Pakistan. It's quite frankly, it's the only Christian NGO in Pakistan that has an MOU, Memo of Understanding, with the Pakistani government, which is pretty telling. They've been around for 20 years, and they are doing great work among unreached people groups, but also they are equipping church leaders in rural areas who have very little access to uh, the type of education that maybe many of us are used to. And also they are enabling the church to participate in mission to its own people through uh, a variety of projects. And these are the projects that we're going to be looking at on our way from Karachi all the way north to Islamabad. Also, while we're in Karachi, I'm going to be interviewing Andrew Hart, who is the CEO of Pac 7, one of our partners there. And they do just fabulous ministry, uh, reaching uh, the majority population through uh, satellite television, uh, which is broadcast actually on national television, and then also through social media and uh, other types of digital media. So, we're excited to do this visit. Then once we're done with Islamabad, uh, which will be about mid-next week or so, uh, on Friday we're going to head down to uh, Fazlabad, which is very close to Jaranwala. Jaranwala, of course, hit the news because that's where there were so many churches being burnt and destroyed uh, last October. We're going to see some of those churches. We're going to see some of the people, the pastors who were there. And I look forward to interviewing uh, some of them and bringing those to you as well. Our, our hosts there um, are going to be Pakistan Christian Recording Ministries, a longtime partner of ours. But we want to bring greetings to the new executive director, Akasha Manuel. He's a fantastic young man with a great vision. And then also we're going to participate in the grad first graduation ceremony of uh, of several rural pastors, about uh, 30 or so, uh, who have just graduated from the Ministry Essentials Training Program that we are supporting through Pakistan Christian uh, Bible Correspondent School. Uh, be greetings to uh, Deal Samuel, and that will be wonderful. I'll be preaching at First Presbyterian in Fazlabad, uh, and uh, the rest of the team is going to be scattered in various rural congregations. And then after that, we're going to head back to Lahore, and we will head on a home to, on a plane. So it's a very full trip, very exciting trip. What excites me most about this trip is just being in touch with the people of Pakistan, those Christians there who are really persecuted heavily. Uh, Pakistan is number seven on Open Doors list of the countries in the world that, were, that where Christians are the most per severely persecuted. It's one of the only countries on that list of top 10 that we can actually get into. So it's wonderful to be among them, to hear their stories and bring those stories back to you. So I just really am looking forward to that. Always do when I go to Pakistan. It's about the people. And what we'll be bringing to you uh, a few times, maybe three or four, uh, three or four, maybe more, depends on how we have access to internet. Uh, we'll be bringing blogs to you through video. Uh, we call them vlogs or vlogs. And uh, it, it, we'll be updating to you through the trip. You'll be hearing from the other trip members uh, and um, so even some other people that we will meet. Looking forward to bringing those to you. Thank you for your prayers. Uh, we will return on the 19th of February and uh, looking forward to bringing you an update at that point. Thanks for your support and we are carrying your words of encouragement to the, the wonderful Christians of Pakistan. Uh, God bless.